ladies and gentlemen, nobody here, back finally after a very long time. I can't wait to show you my new toy. I am so excited about this brand new toy. I haven't had anything to record in a while, but now, now I'm excited. Now I've got something to show you, and I apologize for the video quality. Uh, I didn't run the tests necessary to see if it was actually recording properly before I started recording. So uh, the camera, uh, my, my, I had to use the webcam. It was horrible. It was terrible. Whatever. You don't need to hear all that. Whatever. Let's just get into it. Enjoy. Mike tripped up on my cord. Oh, no, it costs a shadow. <laughs> so exciting. No, you don't understand. I've been waiting for this since lawnmower man. man. Lawnmower? Lawnmower man. The lawnmower man. It's a movie from the 80s. The choppiness, it comes and goes, so I apologize for that right off. My computer is only so close to Right. Oh, 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 okay, here we are. Here we are. Hi, guys. Me again. All right, I'm going to need to... My left and right? What do we got going on here? All right, all right. So here, in the lab, you can't actually walk around so much. I guess you can a little, but... Um, to get the areas you can't reach, you teleport. He's with a nutty! I heard that. Hello! Hit me in the Hello. face! How you going? Oh yeah! Hi! It's blurry. There we go. Why is it blurry? Stop being blurry. Hi! You wanna go play? How do I how do I go play with you? Whoa. Alright, so you pick this up. It says uh Zortex 26XX Experiment Xanax Omega Description. Uplinks a drone fighter capable of maneuvering through a hail enemy fire as it shoots down attackers. Comments? QQ. Okay, so if you haven't figured it out yet, I'm stupid excited about... Okay, I don't know where I am now. Sorry, my perimeter. All right. Open experiments complete. Oh, what's this? I don't think I saw this before. Let's see. Open experiments. Name complete. Okay, so I have completed Zortex 2XX. Sure. I have completed the solar system. Let me show you the solar system. This was really exciting. It was exciting enough I did not wait. <laughs> I wanted to wait and play anything until I could record, but unfortunately, that's not working. So good. So we're over here. And this is one of the only things I'm let's get a little closer. Alright. Solar system! Please, with the lag, stop. Experiment Einstein Boson. You guys don't. Get back to work. Description. Relic emits a portrayal of the solar system with all the planets in their correct relative scales. Comments and relative orbit and relative orbital distances. You probably don't want to walk that far. Right. Alright, right, so here's how it works. Grab your globe. Uh, my daughter is joining us today. No one has seen in on this because she's curious about parameters. I might point out the only reason I am able to play this at this time is because my good friend, Crazy Tony, hooked me up with a really cool graphics card. Okay, so there we go. Alright, so, I can walk around, but I'm not going to because I have a perimeter. I'm going to go check out this this, I want to be standing there. Okay. So this is Saturn. Which I can pick up. <laughs> Maybe I'm crazy, but I like it. Oh, cool, it goes back to its original orbit. And... Did I get it? I got it! I got Venus! Ha <laughs> ha! Goodbye, Venus. It was nice knowing you. Hello, Venus. Whoa! Okay, this is the sun. It has cool sun bursts. I know the ceiling is actually up there, so I need to be careful of that. Uh, I can feel... Oh. I don't think I got it. <laughs> Okay, I'm really close to my... Are my perimeters getting... No, the sun's right there, so it just seems like my perimeter's getting smaller. There we go. Alright. Oh, fuck. 
Oh, damn it, it just went by, too. Dad, what game are you playing? Turn. Look how small it is. Now I'm holding two suns, I mean two planets, and I can place them anywhere I want, which is really cool. Well, fuck you, Venus. Hello, Earth. Wanna put you back? <laughs> that was weird. Alright, what's that? Alright, it's Venus. Right. Venus just bounced off the sun. It's only one circle. There you go there. The planet we have here. Uranus. Uranus has rings. Uranus has very dark rings. So dark you can't see them. Unless you're looking at an angle. So is that moving? Very slowly. Go. We have Neptune. Now I wish it would like tell you something more about it, but all it does is tell you it's Neptune. This one's still my favorite. I love this one. Look at Saturn. So no kidding. <laughs> and this is what it looks like on Saturn. Yeah. Don't step on the cat. Well, why are you trying to call them while I'm playing VR anyway? <laughs> Don't step on it. All right, now which button do I hit? There we go. Brings my orb back. Let me put the orb on there. Ah! Back to the lab. All right, you survived that. So good. Congratulations on making it to the end. Good for you. All right, but. I have another one coming up that I'm going to post anyway, even though I didn't do a lot of talking and whatnot. It was just kind of a fun thing. My daughter joins in and whatnot. You know, it's, we just had a little bit of fun, whatever. But I do have something else that I have to throw into the editing room still that I can't wait to show you guys. And I hope I can get it to work because I had a lot of technical difficulties. That's my name, technical difficulties. But thanks for watching, and hopefully we'll see you next time. Peace!